Disney Princess, The Little Mermaid, Ariel's Royal Meridian. Oh, very good. Princess Ariel had loved Prince Eric from the moment she first saw him. Even now, she was a mermaid and he was a human. And Eric had loved Ariel from the moment he heard her sing. The pair had faced struggling trails to be together. But now, that was all behind them. They were finally getting around. They ended up in a friend and standing with a royal parade. People from all over the kingdom came to see for a new princess. <laughs> I never, I can be a princess. Ariel she had never been to a human wedding before. So she had a lot to learn while in a village. She had over it that human lantern dance that at weddings. Ariel wanted to surprise Eric area with a beautiful dance. So she asked Grungy to each her something new. Grungy was busy getting the castle ready for the wedding, but he always had time for Ariel. One, two, three, one, two, three, Grungy said. As he sends the area in a moment. Before long, she was twirling across the floor like an innocent. Well done, Princess, Princess said. You will look so elegant dancing in your sweating dress. Wedding dress? Ariel asked. Grunkin said that Kong would be the best person to ask about a wedding dress. When Ariel found the closet, she had looks at lots of questions. What does a human wedding dress feel like? It's, it's hard to walk human dress dresses and usually following and white. And always beautiful, Karin said. <laughs> we can design something that's just right for you. Dear. Ariel and Kanga got to work. Stretch them. One dress idea after another. Ariel loved the soft white and curtain. Kanga seducts it, but something was missing. Could we add some green here and here? Ariel asked. Pointing to one of the Congress searches, I want to have something that reminds me of the sea. Perfect, Charlotte. I'll take this design to the royal dressmaker right away. She began to leave the room, but paused in the doorway. I promise you will have no problem walking in. She told Ariel with a smile, you just have to be careful not to get any take on it. Take, Ariel said. There was a happy fairy to my sister. Oh, come on. I'm just a guest for you. The next morning, Ariel visits Shell Lucy's in the kitchen. He was busy hunting the wedding maiden and baking. And simple wedding cakes. Chef Lewis, I don't know what a proper human wedding cake is like, Aaron Tinted. Don't worry, Linda, he said. I will bake you the most delicious, most delicious wedding cake in all the land and sea. What form would you like to it to be? Chocolate! Ariel says we've found Sister Hansen. Then she added, and maybe it could have seen. Salt Kangen felt him. 
seesaw. Kong and the Hat always being one of the father's Nevada, favorite treats. The wedding plans. We're almost finished. Ariel found Grung in to see if there was anything else she could help with. All that he says it was a gas gentleman, Grung said, pulling out a giant roll of says What is the list so long? Ariel as in surprise. A wedding is for the family as much as it is for the bride and groom, said Groovy. Then may Ariel think about her own family. Because they all live under the sea, she added. It said that they wouldn't be able to come to the wedding. And yet, in all her performances, she saw things that remind her of them. Uh, Ariel went back to her room to think as she's appointed she presents and all the wonderful the wedding plans she remembered. What Gong is had on her a wedding is for family. It was Ariel's prime to spend the rest of her life as the human. But she still wanted to learn honor her past as a mermaid. Most of all, she wanted her family close by on her wedding day. She began to her sad. What is if my two sat? I know where my run. Eric found later Eric found Ariel alone on the balcony. Looking out at the sea, he noticed it in Ariel's eyes. What's the matter? he asked. I want a human wedding. But I just wish. I just wish that my family could be there too. And we don't have to, to have the wedding at the palace. Eric said softly. Of course. Eric explains. We can have the wedding at the sea on the board your ship. Then everyone, both humans and frogs, can come. I wouldn't have been any over a way, Eric said. Human area, tiny. After all, Ariel added, that ship is where I first has saw you together. Ariel and Eric found Grungus and told him all about there is new criticism plans of the, for the wedding. The the morning of the wedding finally arrived. Constantly held, Ariel put on her wedding dress. It's beautiful, Ariel said. I just know this day will be everything I hope it would be. Together, Ariel and Con make their way into the yeah, wedding yeah, yeah. ship where everyone was waiting for them. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. It's mine for you. Uh, don't be sad to see human next. The human guesses this. We're all seating on the deck. Yes, in deck. Okay. Look, my friend, look, look. Look, 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 on from the sea. Ariel's father used the magic of the person to lift him and her sisters, but to sit the side of the ship. Everything was still. Then the music began to play, and Ariel walked down the sun into Eric's side. How about the side? Taking few minutes, um, because I might go as I does to see God. The woods were made 
The rings were exactly. Go ahead. She cried to the basin. And at last, the prince and Tag were and we were married. After the wedding, everyone celebrated together. Thank you so much for finding your ring. Sheldon Wilson brought out the wedding cake. Chocolate with sea salt, and a filling. He had even made a special second cake just for the near guests. Oh my near guests. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. I said, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that goes so yummy. Yum, 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 yum. You as Eric well, was enjoying Saturday. his last bite of cake, Sebastian did not didn't see animal orchestra to start playing. Are you ready for start playing? Yay! <laughs> I have a surprise for you, Ariel said happily. She took Eric in her hand and began dancing just like Grungus had taught her. They were soon joined by other human cousins, and they're going to begin dancing together in the ocean. Whoa, that is a fun. It's not true. Eric and Ariel's wedding day was a celebration for the both land and sea. The beginning of a life followed with joy and laughter, shared with family and friends of all kinds. As the couple waved goodbye to their forgets, Eric and Ariel knew this way it was a day they would remember forever. Thank you so much. Yeah! Remember forever!